cool what's up what we're going to do here is called um, a two worlds inception type sort of um, i guess reflection shot and uh, you can have two of the same or two different i'm going to show you two different ones today have a check in the link below for the plugin for this effect step one drag both clips into final cut pro what you'll need is a drone shot uh, quite still moving forward i would say that's what works for me step two what you want to do is drag the y down so that your picture's horizon line goes below the middle of the frame make sure they look quite similar they both have sort of like a horizon in the shot then drag one clip on top of the other clip step three then you rotate that clip 180 degrees on your inspector browser step four what you want to do is move the clip that's on top on the y-axis so upwards in a straight line just above the horizon step five search in the search bar for a tool that's already in final cut pro it's called a graduated mask uh, get that graduated mask and drag it on top of your top clip step six now you know amend and play with the on-screen controls to make sure that it sort of diffuses in the right way so i would say bring up one of the um centers to the one of the centers to the horizon line take the other on-screen control and Make sure that it shows the sky of the top clip or the bottom. In this case, we're doing the top clip. Play it through a couple of times. Step seven. Remember with this effect, the clip you choose will be very important. So usually they have to be both going forward or both panning because once it doesn't align in terms of its movement, it can look a little bit weird. I'm not gonna lie, a little bit weird. If you're enjoying this so far, make sure you like down below. So right to the point where it actually starts panning sort of different ways, I selected all of my clips and cut them, Command B, just to make sure I have a straight moving forward sort of clip instead of ones that pan. All right, thank you very much. Below will be a download link for these effects. So if you enjoyed this tutorial, uh, you can do the exact same thing with a quick handy effect that I've made for you. It's pay what you feel they're worth. If you wanna pay zero dollars, you can pay that or you can pay anything above. So thank you for your continued support. Make sure you like down below. And if you have any questions or requests, send them my way. Smash that like button and I'll get more of these tutorials out to you.